design of an of waste disposal with sanitary landfill method. Final disposal site or FDS is a place where waste reaches the final stage in its management. In realizing the need of our facilities and infrastructure for final disposal sites or FDS for garbage, it is necessary to calculate pricely so that the land provided for the landfill can accommodate all the way. Sanitary landfill is a standard method used internationally in which waste converting with soil layers is carried out every day so that potential disturbances can be minimized. Many cities in Indonesia have not implemented this system because of the difficult in calculating land area requirements and landfill cover needs. So, the purpose of this study is to provide an example of how to calculate land requirements and landfill requirements for the sanitary landfill system. The amount of waste in a city is determined by several factors, including population growth, level of economic development, agriculture and per capita income of the population, and the method of final waste disposal. Open dumping is a simple disposal method where waste is only spread out at a location left open without security and left after the, place, the location is full. In control landfill method, garbage leveling and compaction are also carried out in increase the efficiency of land used in and the stability of the pile of the surface of FDS. Sanitary landfill is the standard method used internationally in which the covering of waste with a layer of soil is carried out every day so that potential disturbance can be minimized. FDS location requirements given the large potential for causing disruption to the environment. The selection of a landfill site must be done carefully. It must not a geological thrown area, such as fault area, landslide area thrown, earthquake thrown, etc. Not a hydrogeological area, an area with a groundwater depth of less than 3 meters. The type of soil, it is easy to absorb water, not close to water resources, not a top topographic thrown area, slope of land should be less than 20%, not an area thrown to flight activities, minimum distance from the airport is 1.5 till 3 km, not a protected area, not a flooded area with a return period of 25 years. In the sanitary landfill system, closure is done every day, while control landfill is recommended every three days. The purpose of land closure is to cut the life cycles of flies, prevent rat breeding, reducing rainwater infiltration, reduces pollution and odors, increase the stability of the embankment surface, improve environmental aesthetic. The kind of Cover soil are daily ground cover, intermediate ground cover, and final ground cover. The terms of the cover soil phase for sanitary landfill consist of daily cover soil coverage between two until four layers of daily cells. Final cover soil is of 50 until 100 cm thickness. The capacity for land area is influenced by the method used, bottom depth of the landfill, fill height, volume of waste removed, compression, and the ability to reduce the volume of waste at the source. Cover soil has very large uses including for prevent trash and prevent odors and etc. 
Cover soil between layers is soil covering the garbage after the garbage reaches a height of 0.8 meters and has been com compacted. Cover soil criteria are as follows. The landfill density is 0.6 ton per cubic meter. Cover soil thickness 15 until 20 cm. Cover land can come from cliff cuts, excavated land at the location, or land taken at the FBS location. The results of the calculation of waste volume projection from 2019 to 2028 are presented in this figure. The calculation of waste generation production is 2 liters per person per day and increases by 0.02 liters per person per day per year while surface level is 60% and increasing by 1% per year. So, we can see that the total large area requirements is 0.33 hectare per year. In this picture, we can see the figure of the cells with criteria cell wind 1.5 till 3.5 times blade wide, maximum cell height 1.20 meter, and slated, ratio, uh, slated side ratio is 1 in 3. This figure is soil cover plan with criteria, closing is done every day, soil types are not impermeable, slope ratio 1 in 3, cover soil thickness 15 until 20 cm. The age of the, land of, the, of the landfill is calculated to estimate how long it will take for before closing. Based on the result of the division of zone 1 to zone 5 and consisting of 16 blocks that have been described previously and by using the cranial method as a landfill method, the calculation of FDFDS can be calculated from each block as can be seen in this figure. In this figure, we can see that the higher cover layer, the less soil is needed. The amount of waste generated by garbage will be 1,194,399.50 or 477,766 cubic meter in solid waste. The needed for landfill area obtained from the design with each height can be seen in this figure. For example, in block 1 with a waste volume of 2,700 cubic meter divided by cell height 100 uh, 1 meter multiply cell wide 8 meter multiply cell length 10.61 meter is 20 days and so on as shown in this figure and this is for all of us a right plan makes easy life thank you Because the time for presentation is very short, so if you want to know more clearly about this paper, we can discuss it by email below.